Potentially a night of excitement ahead at one of the most famous stadia in world football. We are at Anfield here in Liverpool. I'm Derek Ray and joining me here on the commentary box is Lee Dixon. And we've got Champions League group stage action to look forward to this evening. It is Liverpool against Paris Saint-Germain. Yeah, the long road to the final starts here in game one. Always think that if you win your home games and don't lose your away games, you've got a good chance of progressing. This is how Liverpool start the game. And they are a team, Lee, known for their aggressive high pressing. Well, absolutely. That takes a lot of hard work, a lot of organisation. Force the opposition to make early passes. The weakness of it, if you beat the high press, you can get exposed at the back. words that resonate with football fans the world over whether Liverpool supporters or not this is Anfield well it is and that is the cop behind the goal probably one of the most famous iconic stands in world football introducing the Paris Saint-Germain starters the neutrals favorite Gigi Buffon starts in goal Thiago Silva plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Adria Radio starts alongside Marco Verratti in the engine room. And it's become less and less fashionable in the modern game. But it's two up front this evening. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway. Alexander-Arnold has it. Now Mo Salah. Well, PSG have been in building mode for many a year now, and make no mistake, Lee, the Champions League will be the most coveted prize of all for them to win. Yeah, absolutely. The group stages in the past have not been a real problem for them. And somehow kept out by Gigi Buffon. Wow, full length, full stretch. Oh, what a save. And played short. Henderson. Well, is he going to give them the advantage? That will give them quite the lift. An early opening goal lead. Well, you always want to start quickly, and there's a, certainly a quick start there. What a finish. Well, here's the replay, and the power he's got on the shot nearly knocks the bar off the post. What a finish that is. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? <laughs> Fabinho now. And the danger clear. Roberto Firmino, and now in a dangerous position, just what the Liverpool fans wanted to see as they extend the lead to two goals. Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target, you can't score unless you do, and on this occasion he does, and he scores. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. This is Salah, 
It's a highly promising Liverpool attack, but will there be an end product? Keita. Opportunity it is. And in the net this time for Liverpool. Well, they inflict a lot of pressure on the opposition, and that time the opposition couldn't cope with it. Well, it's not a brilliant goal, but it's a goal. It's in the back of the net. Keeper couldn't do anything about it. A chance to revisit the goal. The corner played into the box. Bavati. He's beaten his man. And this time, it's in! Well, I just love to look at perfect technique, and you won't get any better than this. It's just a dream strike. Brilliant, brilliant effort. Well, a bit more analysis as regards the goal. Asking the referee how long to go, looking over at the bench, staying focused is a skill. Intelligent threaded pass here, and Cavani's in. Perfect for the Parisians, PSG have scored. Celebrate, young man, celebrate, it's a brilliant finish. Well, let's see that again. Once he gets into his stride, he just strolls past players. What a lovely solo, wonderful effort this is. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. Taking the corner, Di Maria, Neymar! And it's a goal for Paris Saint-Germain to square this game. Well, it's almost a perfect headed goal. Brilliant delivery into the danger area. Good movement, back of the net. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? It had an invitation, and it is over for tonight at any rate. And hardly the perfect start for Liverpool in the Champions League. A couple of points frittered away in the opener. Well, he can't really complain. It's not an ideal start. Three points would have been the target at the start of the night. And there's a little bit more pressure just been piled on them now for game two. Well, it's always an enjoyable experience watching Neymar. Lee Dixon, your verdict on his performance? Well, they say it's 90 minutes long. They remind you that when they're coaching you as kids. Play to the final whistle, and he did that, and he got his team the equaliser.